this week's tarot. Hey guys, how are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Just jumping out to do this week's tarot. Um, what do we need to see for this week? Um, and of course, this can apply uh, individually or macro level. So it's really up to you because everybody's on a different journey. And so whatever is your situation, this is a general reading and it is applies to everyone because it is universal. So <laughs> uh, starting off with this week, we're going to have this here situation come up. So the ace is always something new, right? And so divinely new inspiration. So with the this card here, this words, it's about new thoughts, right? Coming in. Source has given you a new idea, right? To move forward. And when we get these new inspirations, new ideas, we want to go ahead and go forward, right? With it, right? And so go on the journey. From there, you'll be led if you go on the journey. And that can be whether it is you're looking for a new job, a new relationship, maybe a house or a new car, whatever. Follow your instinct. Use the manifesting principles, right? Follow your urges. Contemplate. Meditate. You know, connect. Get into the space, right? Now, you may be in a place where you may not have at the moment what it is that you need to get there. So say you're looking for a house, but you don't have money for the, the car or for the down payment or for whatever the case may be, and you may feel stuck. Like, how am I going to get there? I know what I want now, right? But how do I get there? I don't have the means to do it. And so we may feel stuck. Look at all the turmoil going on there, and then they can't see, and they're, they're all bounded up, right? But it's right there. All you got to do is step on the path. The water will take you flowing through, you know, to where you need to be, right? And so you just need to step on the path. The water's flowing, but you're cutting yourself off by being there. So you can see how kind of a drought it is. There's not a lot of water, but there's a little bit of water. But if you can just let go of all the stuff that keeps you from it, you know, it'll start flowing more, right? Because water is like flow, right? And so we want to be in flow, not cut off in a drought. And so it can lead to turmoil, stress. How am I going to get there? Suffering, you know, with situation. Because you're in a situation that you don't want to be, right? And so from there, mental turmoil, right? And not being able to sleep, not being able to focus, not be able to contemplate, you know, on it. But we want to quiet the mind, meditation, right? And so bring yourself into alignment. Use the manifesting principles, right? King of Swords, right? Allow the master of yourself to come in, the higher source. Allow source to take presence, right? And so when we can quiet our, our mind and we can allow the principles of source, the higher consciousness, the awareness to come in, and to guide us, right? Because if we are mentally chattering, you know, about our turmoil and our suffering, we don't know how to get there. We're not going to be able to hear Source, right? And then when we can let Source come in, right? And this is um, predicting the higher consciousness awareness of what we're actually wanting, right? To create, or on our soul level, or, or our own personal level, or on the macro level, you know, this is what is going to be the outcome, right? So joy, abundance, happiness, bliss, right? You're going to be on your way. Now, it's something that can happen very quickly, right? And also, it could be a bumpy road depending on what you're choosing because if you're choosing to be this one, you're going to have the bumpy road. <laughs> but if you're choosing source, it's going to be a lot more smoother for you. All right. Now... In the end, you know, you're going to take your place, right? You're going to be in that space, like, in bliss, you know, because when you receive something new or something 
thought you've always wanted or something that you've been manifesting. We're always in this space, right? We're kind of like in this blissful state, right? And so we're able to take the actions and be the one in the role in the play. We're no longer suffering, right? So we're no longer this person, but we are the inner child, the, the one that is coming in and having a new present, right? And so we're in that joyful space, that youthful happiness, joy, right? If that makes sense. And then everything else will fall away, right? And so we have to let our stuff fall away, what no longer serves us um, in order to move forward, right? And a lot of people, again, I don't read cards as they are meaning through the book. You know, I read them by what comes to me. So with this, sometimes this just means that, you know, this person is more of a person who can't play nice. <laughs> we'll just say it that way. Um, but in this card for this typical reading, you know, it means that, you know, you have to let go of the things that no longer serve you. And as you are moving forward, you know, in this person, you know, things are going to fall away that you no longer need, right? They're going to leave and you have to be able to let that go because you can't take that with you because it no longer aligns to you where you are in your new space, right? Which is this one. And then you have the world, right? So everything then shifts. So um, it's the evolution of creating something and manifesting um, something that you want. So um, there's going to be this week new ideas coming in and you just have to move forward with it without fear, without judgment, without um, black thoughts, you know, and just be in alignment with it as it comes in, you know, you, you want to take that opportunity. All right. So hopefully that's helped. So look out for that uh, this coming week. And if you get something, drop it below. I would love to hear, you know, what was your uh, inspiration that came in, a new idea, uh, something that you're working on manifesting, whether it be a relationship, you know, a new vehicle, a car, a house, whatever the case may be. Um, definitely drop it below and let me know how that goes. All right, happy journeys.